and and we can disagree. You guys, you know, my arguments might not be the. I'm not gonna be able to argue with you because your arguments come from a book that I don't really care to read, right? But what I'm trying to say is that when I hear this separatism of different kinds of people, it's the same shit that you're afraid of, right? You're afraid of the white man coming to you. I'm not afraid of him. I'm not, okay, I'm not. so then what? So then what's the point of pointing at them all the time that they're I'm not the pointing at them all. are subjugating you? I'm not pointing at them all the time either. I'm just, yes, you are. This, this whole setup. Calm is down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Number one. Let's deal with the separatism first. Let's see what God says. Remember, we believe in the book. Right. We don't go by feelings or other books out so that don't correspond with the Bible. So the Lord tells us differently when we read the Bible. Read what you got there. The book of Amos chapter 3, verse 1. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel. So now the Lord, he's mad at us. Because we did some of the things the so-called white man is doing today. We broke God's commandments. So the Bible says, Fear the sport the Lord has spoken against us, O children of Israel. Follow me so far? Come on. Against the whole family. Against the whole family, because we're a family. The so-called blacks. Oh, I'm coming to you real quick. I'm coming to you soon. Sorry. We're a family. So we're the same family that's oppressed. Same family locked up in jails. Same family that's catching hell in this country and all throughout the world. So the Lord said, Read it again from the beginning. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you. Come on. O children of Israel. O children of Israel, come on. Against the whole family. Against the whole family, come on. Which I brought up from the land of Egypt. So the Lord brought us out of the land of Egypt. He's speaking against us. He's angry at us for breaking his commandments. Come on. You only have I known. God said, this family only has he known. This family only has he known, come on. Of all the families of the earth. Of all the families of the earth. Like the Chinese, their family of the earth. Japanese, their family of the earth. The same white man you said we keep pointing at. Their family of the earth. But the Lord said, this family has he known of all the families of the earth. Come on. Therefore, I will punish you for all your iniquities. So the Lord said he was going to punish us for all our iniquities. Jeremiah 17 and 4. He said he was going to punish this family for our sins. But the key thing I want you to understand is that he said this family has he known of all the families of the earth. You understand? So there is separatism. Deuteronomy 7 and 6 again. There is, the Lord is a separatist. That's what I'm trying to explain to you. So it's not that we're just mad at the so-called white man. We just are, are hating on the white man for no reason. I'm just reading us explaining to you, which he doesn't like, who he is, what he did, and what his part is in the Bible. It's just that simple. It's not hard to figure out. But you're taking it personal, and a lot of people out here, they take it personal. They take it personal. Read what you got there. Right, Dude. because they're white. I didn't, so how are they did not God say that? to take it personal? Did God say that? No, but you're saying that these are the people that have made you break the law of the of you ever heard God, the right? singer? You ever heard of the singer Mar Mar Mariah Carey? Yeah. You ever heard of Lenny Kravitz? Yeah, I love that. Mariah Carey yes. looks like a white woman. Not but, really. She got a black father. Yeah, exactly. So her father is black, but some people would, 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 might take her for a white woman. But even though her skin color is that... Okay, but, but I'm just trying to make a point to you. It's not skin color we're on. We're on nationality. You understand what I'm saying? Nationality now? Man, look, if you're not always blonde hair with blue eyes, you're not Caucasian. That's the pure description of an Aryan. If you don't have no, blonde hair, blue, he's not from right now. Look at him. And my man. He got light eyes. Yo, yo, uh, yo, man. What? Yeah. Relax. Not, Relax. Who made that? Who made that chart? Made that chart? I'm, 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 I'm agree with that chart. All right, then don't. You don't but agree, I agree with, with your doctrine. Okay. Just not that okay, chart. Okay. Cool, then. That's all right. cool. I just want to let you know that. Much love. Bro. And I and I'm saying that's cool. I want to agree with that chart. Okay. Okay. Right about okay that's else. cool. That's cool. All right. All right. Why you don't agree with the chart? Oh, because that's a man-made. That's a that's a man-made demographic made off of man-made title, label, shapes, and forms. Ooh, right now, if you was to go to the past, they wouldn't even know how, what are you looking at right now. Right, there, are, right now. there are Caucasians in Chile. <laughs> Hold on. First of all, like I said, when we go into the history and we we search the people, we go into archaeology. You got even 